Hello, today we're going to be doing a service event for your Fleet Guard fuel filter on your ISX 15 liter Cummins engine. We're using the Fleet Guard branded FF5825NN, which stands for Nano Nan. On the side of the can, you're going to see four instructions. The first instruction talks about doing a pre-fill. So there's a cap here in the top. It's got a, a black cap. What we want to do is we want to leave that in and we're going to pre-fill the filter all the way up to the base of this cap. After that, we're going to take the cap out. Step number two says that you want to make sure that your gasket is lubricated. So you don't want to dry gaskets while it's getting out. Step number three talks about going down to a, you hit gasket contact. So we'll actually put the filter on the head at that point and screw it on until the gasket first comes in contact with the head. And finally, step four, it says torque the filter down to three quarters of a turn. Now we're going to get in to taking the old fuel filter off, as you can see behind us on the engine. We have a drip pan below to catch our fuel. Really, we're going to use the band wrench here to loosen the filter up, then we'll take the rest of it off by hand. Okay. So we have the old fuel filter off now, and we're just going to uh, dispose of it as needed. Okay, we've got our, our filter full of fuel now. we still got our cap in. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take a little bit of the fuel, and we're just going to lubricate the gasket on the outside here. Next, we're going to go ahead and we're going to pull our pre-fill cap out, pop it out. We're going to set it here to the side, and then we're going to go ahead and put our filter on. Okay, now what I'm doing is I'm trying to find the location of where the gasket's first coming in contact. All right, we're good right about there. Next, we're going to tighten the filter down. We've got the filter on, we found out where the gasket hits and touches for the first time and we're going to use the indicators on the side of the can to tighten our filter down. So here you can see it says C and then it does three quarters of a turn to D. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to turn it three quarters of a turn and when D lines back up where C was, then we're good to go. All right, now we have the filter installed. It's indexed back around to where D is. And now we know that the filter is installed to three quarters of a turn. Okay, we have just finished putting the fuel filter on. We've got it indexed to where we need it to be to know that we've got it on at three quarters of a turn and the fuel filter's on tight and it's not going to leak. As you can see, we got it indexed to the D location and we're good to go. And that is how you change a fuel filter on an ISX 15 liter engine. Thank you and have a nice day.